All right, Coach, 84-76 over Western here in the jungle. What, what are your initial thoughts on the game? Well, we knew coming into this game, we really challenged them defensively and then on the glass. And I thought in the first half, we really met all of our goals for the most part of holding them under 30. And uh, we wanted to be under 39% from the floor and, uh, and and really hold them behind the three-point line. Uh, we came close. I can't remember if we, you know, the second half was such a whirlwind. I can't remember if we met those. But I know our defensive intensity was through the roof. Um, you know, we really charted the first 13 halves of, of the season. Only once did someone score 40 of us on us. And we were at a lot of quality places on the road at quality programs. And that got away from us a little while. I think we panicked and lost our defensive confidence. But tonight in the first half, I thought that set the tone. Without that, and then how we responded in the second half, I think the lead got to 18. And, and that's a tough team. You know, I think they're a tough team that when they do get down, they got a little loose and played five guards and hit some, some circus shot threes. But just uh, from growing up in that area and knowing what a story program that is, maybe people in these parts don't really know. But, you know, the Final Four trips, they've had NBA guys, the facilities are through the roof. That's really a place that loves and sleeps and eats and cares about basketball. And for our, for our program, that's, that's a really solid win. Now, how, how much more special does that win make for you, being that you're a Kentucky native and you do understand the tradition that Western Kentucky has? Yeah, I think, um, you know, if you look at our last four halves, I loved our first half at Louisville. The second half, we knew that that blow was coming. We knew that haymaker was going to be there, and it came. But first 27 minutes, you know, it's a one or two possession game throughout. And uh, and then tonight we really responded. So definitely it pays roads. We have obviously a, a roster of some Kentucky kids. We recruit that area heavily. And uh, I think just those two scores and how we played, you know, really uh, pay dividends. Now, lastly, you, you've seen some special individual efforts. Uh, Odell going for 41 twice. Uh, George had some monster games. Where does a night like Alex's stand in, in your mind? Well, I think it's not only is it a good sign, that's, you know, the understatement of the year, but, you know, just because I know it's coming together for him. I mean, uh, we've talked probably too much about it. We've thought too much about it. We've probably watched too much film. I mean, it's, you know, at some point it has to kind of flow for you, and tonight it did, and, and in a good way. He was always the recipient. You know, he wasn't uh, the initiator. I think Steve just did a whale of a job. Ian Childs was phenomenal. Uh, like what we got from Mitch and Christian, um, Gaines and Barksdale were really, really super, and so it was a joint effort, and, uh, you know, being able to get Jordan some, some good minutes here as he's coming off a broken hand is always good. You know, we're, we're looking to get him ready. So uh, very, very pleased with the outcome. All right, congrats on the win, Coach.